Hi guys, Mr. McNichol here. Well, glad to be talking to you folks at uh, the 006, I think it is, the uh, particular group I'm, this is for. Uh, I'm going to be talking to you really quickly about your biography final draft and the beginning of the memoir. Sorry, this is not, this didn't come out on Friday like I hoped. It's coming out Monday night. Oops. Anyways, uh, the biography uh, piece, Thursday, February 9th at 11.59 p.m. is when your second draft of your biography was due in. Okay, I need to turn it in at the section marked M2 colon L5 dash biography final draft. Okay, I ended up, I made a mistake as I put it in the announcement. I had to turn it in initially in a section called the rough draft spot. Sorry about that. Okay, sound good? So I'm going to finish grading your rough draft, uh, your final drafts rather this evening. Some folks got them in a little bit later. Okay, we'll work with that. Now, after that, I want you guys to begin working on your next writing project, which will be your memoir. Okay. Now, when it comes to memoir, memoir is a fancy phrase for a story of your life. So in a biography, you are writing the story of someone else's life who affected you. In a memoir, you're going to be writing about an event which affected your life and you're going to be writing it from your perspective okay so the first assignment will be a free write pretty straightforward all you're going to need to do is for a title write one thing that changed my life was and you can write whatever comes to mind Okay. It does not, what you write here does not have to be the final topic for your memoir. Okay. Just write something that changed your life. Okay. It's a warm up. Now I'm going to be saying as well, remember, although it's a warm up, if you put anything evil or seriously concerning in it, I'll have to report to the proper authorities. Okay. Savvy. Uh, but other than that, when you're done, this will be put into M3, your free write on one thing that changed my life was. Your free write on this is going to be put into M3 for module three. Oh, M3. Yay, look what I did. M3 for module three, L1 for lesson one, free write number two, because this is the second free write you've done. So your biography final draft, put that in M2 for the second module. L5 for the fifth lesson, biography final draft, and then you will put M3, L1, free write number two, your second free write, which will be one thing that changed my life, okay? And just write whatever comes to your mind, okay? I'm hoping that everybody had a good weekend. I hope those of you who watched the Super Bowl had a good time watching it. I know I did. I'm not going to tell you who I rooted for just yet. Maybe you could ask me on Tuesday night, and I'll tell you. But I will say we did have friends over, and it was an incredibly, incredibly exciting game. Not one that's going to change my life, but it was an incredibly exciting game, and I had a good time. Okay? Once again, if anybody has any difficulty, let me know. Uh, what you are going to be doing, just as a preview for what we're going to be talking about on Tuesday night, for your uh, memoir piece, you're going to be writing a two to three page paper just detailing an event that changed your life. It doesn't have to be the big life-changing event. You don't have to tell me how you met your spouse of 30 years unless you want to. Okay, But it could be an event that did change the direction of your life in a significant way. That's the easiest way to do that. An event that changed your life or heavily influenced your life or made you think about something in your life, whatever that might be. Okay. Topics. Well, again, for some people, it might be meeting your significant other. Uh, it might be when you decided to do this job. It might be when you decided to return to college and go here at TCC. It could be any one of a number of things. Okay. So, uh, I'll look forward to seeing you guys next Tuesday, or this coming Tuesday night, and uh, I hope everything's going well for everybody. Okay. Once again, email me if there are concerns or issues, and uh, I'll address them then.
All righty. Thanks a lot, everybody. I'm having a great time working with you, and I hope we can keep everything straight, and we will have no more week-long unexpected, um, what's the word I'm looking for, events to keep us from moving forward. Okay. Take care. Thanks again. Bye-bye.